Hi, my name is Brian O'Neill Hughes. I'm the Senior Product Manager for the Photoshop team, and today I'd like to give you a sneak peek of just some of what we're doing around content aware in Photoshop. For this first image, let's look at a shortcoming of some of what we do in content aware fill now. So I've got a distracting part of the image here, this pavement on the left. I've made a loose selection. I'm going to ask content aware fill to fill that in, and for the most part this does a great job, but sometimes when you're too close to your subject, as I am here, I'll copy in the wrong stuff. What I want is the ability to drive this and tell it what to put where. People have been asking for this for a while in the patch tool, and that's just what we've given them. So with the same loose selection, I'm just going to drag that over here and say paste from the right hand side of the image into the left. And that's just what we've got. Okay, so for this next one, something entirely new. I've made a rough selection of this because I want to recompose it. I want to move it over so it's in the center of the frame. Now, there's no easy way to do this today. I can't use content or fill uh, to remove this because it's just too big of a portion of the image. It doesn't have enough to look at. I can do a bunch of tricky stuff with selections and masking, but that's going to take a lot of time. So no tricks up my sleeve, no selections, no masks. I'm just going to come over here and I'm going to select my new content aware move tool. I'm going to slide this over to the center of the frame, let go. It's going to remove the original and paste in the new one, looking at all the pixels around the edge of the selection. Great result. It's done just what I wanted it to do. All right, let me show you one last example of this. In this case, I've selected the woman on the right, and I want to drop her over onto the other side of the image. Again, no selections, nothing fancy, no uh, advanced selections or masks just a really loose selection. I'm going to drop her over here. It's going to remove the original and paste in the new one. Again, it's done a great job. Okay, so let me show you one last thing that you can do with this. I'm going to make a rough selection up here and I'm going to change the mode of content aware move to extend. And Now I can take this and grab that and extend it. Do all sorts of unusual things. Okay, so there you see just a little bit of what we're up to around content aware in Photoshop.